Hey, what's up? We got this pedal. We wanted to check it out with you. It's a Sushi Box Elementary, and it is pretty stinking sweet. It's cool. It's, it's awesome. really cool. This thing, it has a big brother in the Sushi Box family, the Dr. Watson. It's based off of like a 70s high watt. Uh, DR-103 is what it is, and it is cool. Yeah, so I guess let's talk about what's all on it. You've got in and out a uh, quarter inch only, no XLR, but I don't seem to mind because this is the smallest preamp. It's tiny. And, and it there's a tube great. in it. Freaking tube there's in it. There's a tube. We love a tube. <laughs> Bass players love a tube. <laughs> we love a tube. So, yeah, it's got that. You got master and gain up top, and then just three band EQ. Yeah. And it does the job. <laughs> So, first of all, Sushi Box sent us this to check out. We yeah. appreciate them doing that. They gave us Thank no you. parameters and, <laughs> like, you know, make sure you say this. They, no, this is like an actual review, and we really respect yeah. them for that. They sent us this other pedal, the JC Emerald, that's based on a Marshall. Mm -hmm. uh, go check out that video. Back to this one. If, if it helps at all, I thought this was the B15 circuit half the time we were demoing it. And I love the sound of a B15, and it's actually, we said this already, right? It's based off a high wall. And so I'm like... I might like it better. I have a B15 sitting over there and it's like, I might like how this EQ is reacting more. And I like that generally I, and maybe, you know, you two, I don't want to speak for you. We're not hired to play really overdriven, yeah. drivey sounds all the time. And he makes sure to mention that this is a mostly clean preamp. Mm -hmm. We could overdrive it I'll when say, we got, really crank it. has got the capability. Yeah. yeah. And you can do that edge of breakup thing, mm -hmm. but I liked it like, on the edge of edge of breakup, like not yeah. really even hearing much breakup. <laughs> You know, I, I don't know what else to say besides like, Really impressed with this. Yeah, 180 bucks, and <laughs> yeah, I the, I kept saying I wanted to get it as like, like I, I would play with it on my main board, but I yeah. would take that only on a fly gig. It's I would tiny. throw that in the backpack, take yeah. it, and have a great sound out of it. So yeah. seriously, really cool, like kind of just approach to it, very different than what we're usually playing. We're both on these huge tube preamps, so yeah. to see something like this completely different and to fall kind of in love with it yeah really cool man so that one will probably be staying with me <laughs> did i did not expect to like this as much as i did yeah i thought it was going to be like a cool little box that's awesome love it but it's like this sounds good it sounds really good <laughs> it sounds really good there's so. no corners taken and yeah honestly it's just the right amount of control and the right amount of yeah. this is the tone with that being said the eq is fairly subtle yeah. not as subtle as the marshally one that we've already talked to in that other video subscribe go watch that video <laughs> subscribe uh i felt there was just enough like i found myself a lot yeah. maxing out the mids mm -hmm. or cutting the mids all the way don't be afraid by what your eyes are telling you mm -hmm. when you're using this like you can crank these knobs all the way and it yeah. and it still is going to be like kind of within the realm of being fairly subtle so yeah i agree yeah any last thoughts man overall pretty stinking cool yeah, it was awesome. So thanks, Sushi Box, for sending us. Hope yeah. you enjoy it and check out our other videos. See you.